Hi everyone. Today I'm making a cinnamon mocha. It's cold and snowy outside, so that sounded perfect to me. Um, so I'm starting with hemp barks, hemp infused CBD coffee. And this is great because it's got, it's a uh, regular coffee, but it also has chaga mushroom, which has so many benefits. My favorite is it helps with uh, inflammation, which can cause so many problems. But most of all, you know, if you feel bloated, if you feel uh, puffy, that, you know, you have inflammation and um, it just, it's just so uncomfortable to be inflamed. It also affects your organs. So anyway, this is really good. It also helps curb your appetite and there are just so many benefits of the chaga mushroom, which I love. Um, and I've talked about it before. So I'm just using one of these packets, which is the Hemperx coffee. It's so easy. So if you're in a rush, you just open it, pour it in your cup. Uh, if you want it a little stronger, or if you want it like espresso, you can just do about three tablespoons of boiling hot water with one of these. And then I'm using the Keto, the Hempworks Keto Coffee Creamer. And this is uh, mocha flavored, like I mentioned before. Now this has uh, MCT oil in it, and it's got Garcinia Cambogia which is really great for uh, appetite suppression, uh, weight loss, it helps you burn fat. Yay! Uh, this is the little packet. So again, it's so convenient. You just open it, pour it in, mix it up. Um, so this is mocha flavored. They also have hazelnut and vanilla, which are I love both of them. Um, the mocha I'm mixing today with cinnamon Hempworks CBD oil. So the coffee already has CBD oil in it and the creamer has MCT oil. So both of those are going to help uh, your joints, going to help you uh, just your sense of well-being. It can level your, uh, balance your sugar levels. It's just, you know, all these ingredients together make this just super power coffee. And you're not gonna feel the jitters from it. But I like to have, this is the 500 milligram of CBD with cinnamon flavor. So I put just uh, three drops in it. Depending on how much cinnamon flavor you like, you can play with that. Uh, the cinnamon and the mocha together, I just really love the combination, especially on a cold day. And you could even go a step further and make uh, Mexican mocha. If you like it a little, a little spicy, you can add a little cayenne pepper. I wouldn't add too much, just, you know, barely, barely an eighth of a teaspoon. That might be too much for you as well. So maybe just a slight dash, but play with the flavoring if you want to do the Mexican mocha. And I'll probably do another video on just that. But so we've got the mocha, which has the MCT oil in it and the Garcinia Cambogia and really good flavor. We've got the coffee that has the chaga mushroom and the CBD in it. And then we have a little more CBD, not a lot. So what you're gonna get is you're gonna get um, energy, a boost of energy, and it's, I like to do this, and it's really good for your workout as well, but you're not gonna get that jittery feeling that you normally do with coffee. And that is awesome because you'll get a nice clean energy boost that can last for a long time throughout the day, which is important when, you know, especially if you're drinking your coffee, you're working out, then you're going to work and then maybe you want to do another workout or maybe just your day itself is a workout, you know, chasing after if you have kids, you're, you're working out all day. So, um, you know, it's really challenging sometimes after drinking coffee in the morning, then you get to about two or three o'clock and you just hit that lull, you know, that really low energy slump. Um, with this, because you're not gonna have the sugar crash or it's gonna help you level and regulate your sugar levels. It's, not gonna, it's also helps with, the chaga mushroom helps with uh, blood pressure, regulating blood pressure. It's also really good for the cardiovascular 
health. Um, so you're going to be getting basically all these superfoods and health inducing ingredients in your cup of coffee in the morning. And you know, if you want to have another one in the middle of the afternoon, just for the fun of it, that's great, but you're not going to feel that desperate. I need coffee to get through my day. Um, I also noticed just a, an amazing sense of uh, well-being, you know, drinking this coffee as opposed to regular coffee. And I don't get the acidity, the, um, you know, acidic reaction that you can sometimes get from regular coffee. So anyway, enough chatting about that. What I'm doing is I'm in putting all these ingredients into my cup and I'm going to blend it. Cinnamon mocha. I didn't add whipped cream to this one. I just put a little cinnamon on top because this is keto friendly and I wanted to keep it that way. Um, this is uh, sugar free. It's sweetened with stevia, gluten free, uh, just uh, completely keto friendly. So that is the end result. Beautiful silky foam on top. I love it. So here we go. Let's see. Very nice. In my opinion, just enough cinnamon. A very silky, silky foam. Like I said before, it's a really good combo. So thanks for watching. I hope you love it.